Greetings and salutations. It is my birthday and my birthday wish is the same as it was two years ago. I want to issue a wild hunt and a wild hunt challenge for you to participate in. And it is looking quite juicy today, but uh, that's not the point of the video. Also, just mentioning it that I've been setting a very high pace over this last year, so I'm quite happy with my performance and I can just say that I live my teachings 100% and the teachings are legit so good things come to those who adhere to the teachings set out by me but enough narcissism I will leave the narcissism for another time now it's not about me it's about you and it's about you participating in this one month challenge so we have a few steps and I will go through them it's the birthday cake that's been um, going straight out to the guns. So anyway, first step is, in all actuality, to read two books. One book is supposed to be a non-fiction book. So something that you can gain additional knowledge and wisdom from. And the second book shall be fiction. And now you might wonder, why do I recommend fiction so much? Well, first and foremost, it is about getting motivation, getting new perspectives. So if you ask, I always motivation to train because look behind you. I've read so many epic books over all these years. And then also you get a sense of a certain time period, for example, or a sense of something epic. So two examples here. Fiction book, Tolkien, right there. Excellent stuff. And a non-fiction book. I've talked about this before. Boom right there so it doesn't matter which books it is but it's also about getting into the routine of reading and uh, even if it's just a fiction book it trains your mind to you know portray a scenario in your mind that is good for your brain so it's basically a workout for the mind that you train it and then also it helps you with um, retaining attention and it's good to take a break from social media if you're um, scrolling a lot that's not good at all if it's just scrolling for the sake of uh, scrolling but if you can gain motivation from social media that's all good so that's why i recommend you to have instagram and you know follow people or accounts that inspire you to set the pace high when it comes to your endeavors such as uh, training etc now anyway first point of the challenge read two books and that will also hopefully get you into the routine of reading books and I can just say this for the sake of it's a nice thing if you feel relaxed you have a cup of tea or a cup of coffee and you sit down with a good book it's a it's an acquired taste but when you find that peace and harmony it's a, it's a very nice sensation indeed so one fiction book and one non-fiction book the fiction book obviously to expand your mind a bit get you to think and also get you to have some additional motivation and the non-fiction book obviously to attain a higher level of enlightenment now second part is something i've talked about before and i won't elaborate further on it right now but it's obviously no porn and not getting drunk and not do any drugs unless of course you have some medical condition which um, uh, stipulates that you can smoke marijuana or something like that but that's only if you have a medical condition and you need to treat it but no recreational drugs whatsoever that is absolutely forbidden and obviously after the one month it's up you shouldn't watch porn after that either but anyway if you haven't already stopped watching porn now is the time to do so so that is step two of this um, glorious challenge step three is actually depending on if you're a beginner in the temple of iron or if you're not a beginner if you're a beginner and you don't know how to do one chin up that is your goal learn how to do one chin up unassisted so that you have a month to learn and after that it's quite easy to add repetitions after that and if you haven't done any dips before your goal is to do five dips and dips are much easier to um, learn how to do than chins now if you are already a disciple of the temple of iron the key is to increase your max amount of reps in the chins with five and in dips with eight. 
So that's something good and the point here is that everyone can participate in it because you can always find an outdoor gym so you don't need to have a gym card. So the point is that everyone should be able to participate in this challenge. Same thing if you don't have any books go to the local library so everyone can participate. And same thing with the gym. Uh, go to an outdoor gym and do these exercises and uh, calisthenics it's, um, it's a good complement but if you don't have access to the gym it's definitely something I recommend you to do. Now the last part of the challenge is uh, well for me my favorite part at least and that is you need to be two glorious lads to do this and that is that you go with your mate to the most epic place you can possibly find and then take a picture together looking aesthetic. So for example if you are in some sort of place you say to your mate okay we need to do this wild hunt challenge because that's the glorious lion's birthday wish and then you go to the most epic place it can either be like some sort of architecture and you strike an epic pose or it can be out in nature and uh, you know have a cool vista behind you uh, that sort of thing is really epic for me to see and then post it, post it on instagram you can tag me in it or you, just, or you can just tag with legio gloria and i will check that out so do that at end of the month and then do the other things as well so to conclude this challenge read two books one fiction book and one non-fiction book to get you into the habit of reading it's a great habit and i can promise you it's very rewarding once you get into it and start reading books on a regular basis second thing no porn no drunkenness and no drugs unless it's drugs you need for health and then third thing is to increase your chins with five and your dips with eight and if you're new to calisthenics then it's to get one chin up and five dips and then lastly to take an epic picture because i find that rather glorious to see and it's also nice to see different lads from different parts of the world going out and uh, you know exploring nature a bit uh, learn to appreciate nature it is it is very good indeed so anyway, that is the Wild Hunt Challenge, my edict and my birthday wish. And uh, I will start the video production in earnest again soon. And that will be glorious. I have a lot of good videos coming out. So thank you for watching and uh, I hope you participate in the challenge. And who am I? I'm the great angel. XXO. Boom.